Hi hey guys, uh, beginning of turn three, Jonathan's just deploying these units that have come out of the Rhinos. Um, and we're going to move right into the turn. Uh, unfortunately, due to time constraints, this will be the last turn, and we will be turning a winner at the end of this turn. So, uh, yeah, follow along, and let's see where we end up. Okay, so my dudes got out. Um, my rhino over here is going to fall back. It gets to move three inches at its current state. I also forgot that my rhinos, it's, I think it's at the end or the beginning of my turn, it's on a six, they prepare a hull point. Um, I'm gonna remember that now. Discontinue for the two turns that have passed. Uh, let me just check what it says, it's beginning or end of turn. Just remember this now. Self-repair, at the start of each of your turns, on a six, this model regains a lost wound. So, needing a six, nope. Needing a six, nope. Needing a six, nope. And the last one, two, no. So, no self repairs happening. So he can move three inches backwards. He can move six inches in this state, or I think even 12, but he doesn't even need to. He's just gonna back up out of this problem here. Um, and that would be that. We're going to do shooting phase now. We're going to start with Watch Captain Artemis. And he has a one shot grenade called the Stasis Bomb. I've only used this one, so I'm going to reread the rules. This weapon can only be used once per battle. If the attack hits, deal D6 mortal wounds to your target. If it misses, watch Captain Artemis suffers D6 mortal wounds instead. So he's going to throw this at your Doom Crawler. Because um, it's a 6 inch weapon. Uh, and he hits you on a 2 up. 3. It's a hit. So he does D6 mortal wounds. You got wounds. a wound still, don't you? No, it's auto. It's mortal wounds, so it doesn't even. Yeah, you still got to roll the hit. Have a, I did. You gotta roll the hit, then you gotta roll the wound still, like anything. Not this one. It has no strength, no AP, no damage. It's just, if it hits, it does D6 That's mortal wounds. It's like a demo charge. It, it just still, hits it's, and explodes. It still should, it's like a regular grenade, though, so when you throw a grenade, you still have to wound once you throw it. That's one time only. So it does two mortal wounds to you. Two mortal wounds. It's like an eight wound model. Yeah, so don't sweat two wounds, man. Come it's on. Just a it's a one time, it's six, a one, six, one time only grenade. Six wounds without having to roll a, a, a wound to, to have them take effect? That's crazy. Yeah. You know, he's 130 points. He gets to use it once, so let him have his bells and whistles. You can you can kill, like, models worth double that. Yeah, essentially. That's ridiculous. So, anyways. He's death launch. Yeah, my tech priest almost cost twice as much, almost twice as much as him, and I don't get bonuses crazy shit like that. So you gotta check into what's lean and mean, I guess. There's no lean and mean. Belarus Claw is the only way I can do anything, and he's almost 300 points, so... Just so, pay the points. Um, shooting, we're gonna do this squad here at your Doom Crawler. Uh, I'm gonna shoot the Combi Melta. This guy with the Storm Shield has a Combi Melta, so I hit you on a 3 up. It's strength 8 versus your toughness 7, so it's a 3 up to wound you. Wounds. Minus 4, so you guys do it have your invulnerable save if you have one. Makes it. Um, we're going to shoot my 3 bolt guns. 2, 4, 6. They hit you on 3s. I'm going to shoot the one that's minus 2 to your armor. So, 5 hit. Uh, strength 4, so it's 5s to wounds. 1. Made it. Um, and I have my frag launcher. For the D6 wounds. I'm going to shoot the shell shot. So it's assault 2. So I hit you on 3 ups. One hit. Uh, if the target is within half range of this weapon, its attacks will resolve the strength 9 and AP minus 3. So I wound you on a 3 up. It's a wound. 
failed. It does two damage. And then those guys that got out of the rhino on the far side over there, tiny. Mm -hmm. <coughs> um, I'm gonna shoot the. Uh, I'm gonna shoot all this stuff at the guys right in front of them. So I'll start by firing the four bolt guns. Two, four, six, eight. I'll fire the one that's minus one AP because you have an invulnerable save, for it. So these are threes to hit. These are threes to wound. One, two, three. Three five ups. Uh, gets what? Against the three Vanguard, are they, over there? This is the five-man squad. Both guns are firing at them. Yeah, they're all dead. <laughs> so the frag shell is not going to shoot because I decided to target all my shots onto them. You can't now retarget. That would be unfair. Um, and that would end my shooting phase. Um, we'll have a charge phase. I'll start by charging my unit of five guys here at your Doom Crawler. Overwatching. And then his big cannon that does D3. Okay, my charge range is a 6. So I'm in. This one is over. Captain Artemis will charge. It's 5. And then these guys will charge at your walker. You want to overwatch with his stubba? And they get a 12. Their charge rate is sheesh. Okay, that's awesome. Crazy, crazy. Um, so, now we have combats to do. Um, Charging units first. Yes, you still have three command points left. I still have five. Four command points left. I've only used one reroll. You use one reroll and one interrupt. So that's a total of three. That's yeah, good. So three. Okay. So you have three left. I have one left. Uh, <sighs> physically impossible for me to win. It comes down to model count. Did you count? Oh yeah. You did. I oh yeah. Counted, yeah. You do, You have fifteen models on the table without even counting anymore. I don't have that many left. 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 22. Two. 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. You feel it, yeah. Well, let's play it out. We made the contents, but I already know what the outcome is going to be. You won the game. I can't kill that many models in this turn. Okay. Plus, you're going to kill more models, so. We'll go with this guy's uh, Xenoface sword over here, and then there's a power sword. So Xenophase needs threes to hit, one hits. I need a five to wound you because your toughness is like six or something. I get a six here. Toughness seven. Okay, yeah, so it still, still wounds. Uh, oh, it's minus something. Uh, minus three. It's like a power sword. It just makes so you reroll uh, successful it's, it's, and vulnerable save. One damage. It's just one damage. It's just a power sword that does that fancy stuff. And then one hit from the regular power sword, needing a five to wound. It's a five. So again, you're taking an invulnerable save, but no need to re-roll it. So now he's down two wounds. Uh, and then I have three guys regular attacking. No. Yeah, three guys regular attacking. Uh, yeah. And two. These are regular attacks, so you take your regular armor saves. down three wounds in total. So it's from six to three. Um, now my guys against your Doom Crawler. I have a I have no power weapons in this squad here. So it's just ten regular attacks. Two, four, six, eight, ten. They're within six inches of Artemis, so they get to reroll once to hit. Two. So twos are removed and threes to hit. And your toughness is seven. Mm -hmm. So these are fives to wound you here. Oof. Um, five. Four wounds. Mm -hmm. From seven to three. Mm -hmm. And now Artemis gets four attacks with a power sword. He needs twos to hit. Fives to wound. None. Um, Artemis was useless there. 
Uh, How's your charging units? Um, we'll go to locked units over here. Did you want to interrupt at all? Anyone? No? Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Um, Xenos face sword. Hitcha. No. Wounding you on a three. Wounds you both times. So two five ups. Re rolling successful because it's the Xenos face sword. I'm just dead. Okay. That's why he paid an extra 15 points for the weapon, but it comes in handy when you run into invulnerable save dudes. Power sword guy here. Hits twice. Doesn't wound at all. These guys just consolidate three inches. Um, this guy here gets his D3 attacks. Three attacks hitting on sixes. Nothing. Um, this rhino gets his three attacks. Nothing. Um, all we have left is the Terminators now. Terminators will no, do... No, Rhino's not in combat. No, he's not. He, ret he fell back. And I actually forgot to shoot my Storm Bolters with my Rhinos that fell back, but they don't... No, they can't shoot. They can't shoot. They can't shoot, sorry. That's like flying units. Flying units can fall back and shoot. Mm -hmm. yeah. they're, they're completely useless when they fall back. Um, my Terminators will have two guys target this guy, and three guys target your your one data slate there. So the three guys targeting your data slate does not include the sergeant, so it's just six attacks, hitting on threes, missing one. And these require twos to wound you. Four. Minus three. You have your invulnerables, so three. And he's dead. That is D3 each. Um, and then the two guys, as a sergeant and a regular guy, needs your doom crawler, needing threes. Got them all. These are strength eight, so they wound you on three ups if you're a toughness seven model, right? Mm -hmm. uh, four. Four minus three, so you have your invulnerable save, I guess. Two. They do D3 each, uh, which would be three and two, which is five wounds in total. So he goes from what, 12 or 11? That's six. 11 minus 12, yes. And I would end my turn. Morale checks aren't necessary because they're. Our you gotta do the other half of the turn. Your half. Like, mm -hmm. No, no, your half of combat and then your turn. Yeah. Yeah, so you, get, you do your retaliates back. I'm just looking at casualties. There are none for morale on your end. So we have. Who up? Strength five, so each. Five, uh, five to win the toughness seven model. Mm -hmm. Three ups. Makes them. Same chicken. No, the other chicken. Oh, okay. to he gets uh, no minus, right? So it's just a three up save. Makes it. That was on the squad. Yeah, yeah, three up save. Their armor. No, I know, but the other one actually hit. Because mm -hmm. I was. Yeah, yeah. So he, I only Another broke. One? Yeah, because I thought I was hitting the. Failed one. So I'll remove a guy with. Because the chicken oh, can't. I thought here. it was attacking the rhino. Sure, but I remove the, the frank cannon. Because I can't attack the rhino. It's kind of useless now. They're very close. I can't attack the rhino because it's not in close combat. to hit threes to wound, if I remember correctly. Yeah, they're, they're the taser goats. Yeah. And sixes, they do three hits instead of one. Just two and three. Mm -hmm. And they're three plus, and then the strike six. It's just threes and threes. Three rolling ones? Oh, no, good. Plus one is three wounds each. Three hits each, right? Three hits each, yeah. So I'm just going to bring you 
dice over Show and then the other one. Yep. And now to wound, it's uh, three up. Yep, just plus two strength, which makes them six. Mm. I can see the advantage of bringing these. It's just wait. Two, four, seven. seven. He's dead. The one model here. I'm not going to make seven there's no, guesses. There's no minus, though, so it's worth a try. <laughs> it's worth a try with my luck. Two, there's four, no minuses. six, seven. For the Emperor. Failed one. He only, he only needed to fail one, but if, if, you, if there were two You still models, have one more turn to go, which is your half of the turn. I want to kind of be cheeky and use my last stratagem, but I won't. Dead. Mm. It's just these guys are going to shoot and charge at these guys, eliminating them. And if I yeah, keep they them can locked, consolidate. They can consolidate too. So three can, inches? Yeah. Just move up so they can. Next turn, you're going to charge in there. Shoot yeah. and charge if and anything's then, left. Uh, your five dudes over here. They're going to just come over here and fight Termes. Yeah. Forced to hit, right? Yep. Yeah. Five to wound. Two up. Save. Bink. Oh, shit. This is the scary guy. He needs to hit. He needs to connect. Four to hit five to wound. That's it. Your turn. Uh, that's the end of the first half of turn three. We'll be back briefly with the second half of turn three. Thanks for liking, watching, and subscribing.